Hey, y'all. Hey, what's up? It's your girl A. And y'all already know what time it is. It's about to be another she in haul, y'all. Okay? Listen, I already told y'all at the second flash sale haul that I was addicted. So I'm just saying, like, girl, I got another package coming, uh, like, Wednesday. This came today. Girl, I'm about to get dressed and go to karaoke night. So that's why I'm all be dazzled up. This shirt also came from the Shein flash sale that I got in today. I'm going to just be honest and tell you this one thing about Shein's t-shirts. They really need to make them t-shirt materials because I don't remember buying any t-shirt anywhere. It is like this rayon polyester type, got you drenching in sweat type of feel. But I thought the t-shirt was cute because of what it had to say. You know, I'm all about blackness because that's me, girl, okay? But I'm just saying, she in. I love y'all. But it'd be like a hit or miss with the t-shirts. Like when I say it'd be a hit or miss, one minute you get something really good like t-shirt feeling and the next minute you get something that's like rayon polyester. Now, whose t-shirt sleeves come all the way down to here? I had to cuff these bad boys up. Got another she in bag. Here we go. Let me just get my little super out the way because y'all need to be talking about me. However, if you choose to, go right on ahead. And when you do talk about me, make sure that you direct whoever you're talking to me about to my YouTube channel so that way they can rate, comment, subscribe, and watch all my videos. Told y'all I love the sunglasses from Shein. You know, sometimes they be like a hit or miss, but so far I've been quite lucky. And I'm gonna just say this, okay? I have a huge sunglass collection that was before Shein. But you know, sometimes things can get a little outdated. You get tired of stuff. You really don't like it no more. You just want to try something new. So I'm just saying, for $2, a dollar, and $3 a pair, you can never go wrong with Shein. So this is in no particular order, girl, but we just gonna get through this real quick so that I can get dressed. Mm -hmm. Girl, I was really wanting these. They were big and round, and I love big stuff, okay? Like, I didn't mean to sound perverted or anything, but I do love big stuff. Now, these glasses was definitely hitting. I swore I was getting these, and I knew I was gonna look too cute in them, okay? Ooh, girl, what y'all think? Definitely cutie patootie. Now, these are definitely oversized, so this way it makes my face look much smaller than really what it is, okay? I like the gradient effect of these. Plus, I do like the lenses, the tint of this. I do like the bigness of these. These are huge. These are definitely like a statement type of sunglass. We got another pair of sunglasses right here. Let's check these out. I think this is like the really fancy pair that I accidentally purchased because I wasn't really sure if I wanted these. But you know when you like half sleep? Like sometimes I accidentally push buttons while I'm looking on Shein and somehow it ends up in my car. And then when it's time to check out, you know, well, I didn't already bought it. These are really cute though. These are different. These are definitely different sunglasses. These are awesome. Really, really cute. But damn, these see that these are absolutely cute should i roll up in there with these on mm. now these are amazing i love the faux gems like the crystals or the faux diamonds that surround the entire frame these are definitely hidden there is an actual frame around the actual frame and i like the tint of them i think the lenses did come in different colors i'll definitely leave all the links below but for me i really don't do cat eye sunglasses too much but because these were so bedazzled and different i figured you know what girl i'm going to get these it reminded me a whole lot of something that Beyonce had. And y'all know, girl, after going to Beyonce's concert, I am like her number one fan right now. I also did get another pair of like some really big square sunglasses that I absolutely love because I'm just like a really big square sunglass wearer. However, they are kind of reminding me of these other pairs that I got, which was in a three pack. And okay, so this is the new pair. And this is the pair that came in the three pack. They look very similar. I think these are the same effing glasses. And they're flimsy too, just like those. So I I feel like these are like the first pair of three pieces that I got a three set. And these only came in a single set. Let me see something because they remind me so much of one another. They do. They really, really do. Either way, I like them. It doesn't matter if they are the exact same pair. They're kind of like on a flimsy side. So I'm pretty sure they're not going to last forever. And they were fairly cheap. I did get these. Okay. So these reminded me of these sunglasses that I had for Barbie when I was a kid. They look just like this pink, like this light pink and this white framing. I had these for my Barbie. Now these are definitely What's up? I think these are really, really cute. Yes. Now, I really do like these a lot. These are cute. These ones, yes. These, I'm really happy that I did purchase. And they were fairly cheap. Now, these came in a cute full leather case. It also came with a sunglass, um, a shade cleaner. And these are the big round ones. Another pair of big round ones. Now, they're not as big as the first round pair that I put on, but I do like these. These are a little bit more subtle. And though I was never a huge fan of round sunglasses, I think like these are different because they're a little bit bigger. Normally, the round sunglasses that I've came across were smaller, so it really didn't do anything to my long face. They kind of made it look even longer. So being that these are bigger, oversized round glasses, I do like these ones. Let's get on to some really cute fingernails that I did get for them, some press-on nails. Shein has like so many different press-on nails. And you know what's so crazy about it? Like I did purchase a couple of pairs from Amazon that were the exact same ones on Shein. Amazon is like three times the price of any Shein products. I've noticed that, especially when it comes to press-on nails. So I thought these were really cute, especially because they're like stilettos. I like like almond-shaped nails or ballerina shaped nails or coffin 
shaped nails and even stiletto shaped nails. And most of the time when I see them, they're not really that pointy, but these are definitely pointy. And I thought these were really cute. The color's nice. They're just basic black, you know, nothing too different about them. Now, will they take some getting used to? Definitely. But you do get a nice amount in the pack. And it also comes with an emery board and some of those little press on stickers that just are really not usable. But I think I paid like at least a dollar or a little bit over a dollar for these. Another set of nails. And these are like a white color and they're also stiletto shape. These are cute. Do you see these? Look how cute these are. These are absolutely cute. They're just basic white. They go with anything. If you love a nice stiletto nail, you can definitely check Shein for them. They're very affordable. This also did come with an emery board and some of those little pasty stickers that you would use if you chose to, to stick on your face, um, your fingernails. And a lot of this stuff was on a flash sale, but you know what I just noticed and realized on Shein? Now, I'm not really sure if it's in every category, but I know it's in the curves section and I also know it's in the women's section. There is flash sale. Then there is 90% off to sale sale. So I just realized that the sale sale stuff is even cheaper than a flash sale and there's a whole lot. So check out the sales section because there's no time limit. It's not like a flash sale. So I do have some items coming from the regular sales section that I'm like totally excited about. Now y'all know I love me some nice eyelashes, but because I'm not like that great with doing eyeliner, I really prefer like the clear bands, something that looks a little bit more natural. I don't really like all of that lash, 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 even though I probably did wear something like that a while ago, I'm totally not into that anymore. So this one came with, I think it's like 12 pairs and this is also a clear band. So you can either wear these as strips or you can cut them up and use them as clusters. These were fairly inexpensive as well. Super duper cute. Mm -hmm. Some glue for my press on nails. This was actually 85 cents and I did mean to purchase a couple of these, but like I said, I fell asleep and then when I purchased stuff, I was like half asleep. So I didn't realize that I only put one in my bag. Now y'all remember my last haul, my last Shein haul number two, where I had purchased a fanny pack and I was like really wanting a new fanny pack. Girl, listen, if you go to concerts, it's really best to have like a fanny pack or some type of clear band. But once you get used to wearing a fanny pack, you just like really want to wear a fanny pack all the time. And I only had a basic black one, but girl, I need to spruce it up a little bit, make it look cute make it do what it do so i did get these on a flash sale and let me tell y'all they are very similar to the one that i do have which is kind of like a knockoff of the lululemon one it's it's called a minimalist uh fanny pack i figured because it was the same kind of like hookah spits okay oh yes so we about to try it out right now now the one thing about the black fanny pack that i have it has compartments inside of it and so does this one right here and i love it it has it's exactly made the same two compartments right here one full compartment right here and then you can put stuff in here and then there's also the back and only because it was the same i kind of figured that it would fit nice and just about the same and from the way the straps is looking girl it's looking very promising okay so this fanny pack is not fitting like a waist trainer thank you jesus this one actually runs bigger than the other one i have which is great i'm not complaining okay so if you're plus size diva and you need a good fanny pack these are like three dollars and twenty cents i still have plenty of room i stretched it all the way out and i still have plenty of room so if you're looking for a nice minimalist size fanny pack i will definitely leave all the links below for these these do come in a variety of colors and there's also different ones from like the different marketplace but they do give the dimensions for these particular fanny packs so that's the one reason why i did get these ones and then i also got it in like this beige color or khaki color as well you can never have too many fanny packs girl but this bag was so cute it was like four dollars now i don't know where I'm going where I'm wearing it too but you know what it's like a silver color silver goes with just about anything girl I'm pretty sure that I could rock this somewhere out I wish I would have had this for the Beyonce concert but girl look cute small silver clutch bag now the, the the handle is plastic which is a downer but it's still a really cute bag it's very small and chic and this is like if you're going for a girls night if you're going to like a Beyonce concert and there's no compartments inside but it does it does you can fit quite a few things in here and it's just really cute I think this is really really cute and I I do believe you can remove this. You can remove this handle if you chose to. Just need to slip it through and just put you on a new handle. You're good to go. But I thought this was actually really, really cute. Now, girl, look, you know, let me tell y'all something. This year, I've been living like my best life. Like, seriously, I have never been to so many concerts in my life throughout this whole summer. I went to the Janet Jackson concert. I've been to the Beyonce concert, Drew Hill, SWB, and Jodeci concert, Girl Drake. Like, girl, listen, I'm not really sure why I bought this now, but I plan to go to like a couple of more concerts before the year is up. Like, I don't know who's going to be playing be Metallica. I'm there, okay? Did get this for the next concert that I go to. And this is what I'm talking about when I'm telling you that I'm half asleep when I purchase something. I really didn't mean to get the white one. It was supposed to be the black one. And when I seen it the next morning that I purchased the white one, I was like, great. 
I need to stop buying stuff when I'm half asleep. But it does come with a strap, and I really didn't want to wear it as like a purse. I was going to wear it as a fanny pack because you can use it as an adjustable strap. And girl, I will I will put this on as a fanny pack. Trust me when I tell you, it'll work. It'll definitely work. But I really did want it to be in black. But it was like four dollars. They have like all these different types of clear bags, and this is this is definitely something you can use when you're going to concerts because they act really weird. They don't like you to bring your purses, bags. Everything has to be see through. So I got me one on standby, but I'm definitely gonna buy the black one because I really didn't mean to get the white one. It's not bad at all. I do like the fact that it has a compartment right here in the front and then here in the middle. So you can definitely put your items in it, which is a, is a plus. Now, I hope this charger works because it was on a flash sale and you can always use like an extra charger. This is supposed to be a fast charger and hopefully it is, but hmm, I don't remember what the price was for this. I'll definitely link it below, but this is for the iPhone. Okay, normally the iPhone does come with the C charger. Mine did too. And oh, this is a C charger iPhone. So I can actually use my iPhone charging cord that came with my phone into this because they don't give you these blocks anymore. But this is a C charger. It's supposed to be a fast charger. We shall see. It was super cheap. It was on a flash sale. Now for one, I love gibbets. I love crops. I have quite a few pair of crops. I like eight or nine pair and every last one of them is gibbeted up to the gods. Like seriously, I don't play when it comes to my crop. I, I make sure that every last hole is filled. That did not sound right, but you understand what I'm saying. Yeah, let's just move past that. So I did get some gibbets from Shein. They have like a lot to choose from. And I mean, you can go to the crop store and buy gibbets, but they're not cheap. And I like the variety that come at Shein. You know what I mean? The colors plus the prices are very reasonable for gibbets. They do get dirty. What I do to clean my gibbets is I take a bowl and I put some Dawn soap in there. And then I just let them soak for like about like 10, 15 minutes. And then I take a toothbrush or cloth and I just go ahead and wipe them clean. So that's how I clean my crops and my gibbets as well. It doesn't have to be an actual name brand Dawn. It could be like the off brand. I think Dawn is really good for cleaning like any type of dirt and debris. And I also do clean my Crocs like that as well with Dawn detergent in a basin. Then I also got some Christmas gibbets. They are supposed to glow in the dark. Came with 30 in here. So this is definitely going to cover a pair of shoes. I love Christmas. Christmas is my favorite time of year. Okay. Y'all know if y'all seen some of my videos during Christmas time, my house is decked out. Three Christmas trees in my house. One very huge one, one medium sized one and one small one. And I put one in each living room. I love Christmas. Plus I have nine inflatables that are outside of my house. And it's just amazing. Christmas is my favorite holiday. So I definitely definitely was happy to get these. I cannot wait to put these on my shoes, girl. You know, I had to get these ahead of time because during the holidays, you ain't gonna find these. I did get these other gibbets. Um, how many came in here? I'm not really sure how many came in here, but it was all pink. It was like Barbie pink, all kind of little girly girl stuff. Pink poodles, little pink scooters. This one came with like 26, I do believe, but everything is pink in this one. So look, y'all, y'all know I love some jewelry from Shein. And when I tell y'all that, it doesn't seem like the jewelry tarnishes that quick. It really doesn't. I'm still wearing my bangle set from this. Them. and I do see a little bit of a reddish tone is turning to but nothing like major and this is another bangle set but as far as this one it has different engravements on it and um, this, it also does come with more. Now this one here only came with four. This one comes with seven and it's made the same way, but it just has different engravements on it. These are really, really cute. And I'll definitely leave the information for them down below. And then another set of bangles. These don't have any opening. These are just the typical bangles. I think it's like a set of 12 that it comes with. Really cute and chic. If you don't want your jewelry to tarnish, especially if it's not real gold, get you like some acrylic um, spray paint and you can spray them on there and it will definitely keep your jewelry last much longer. Some people say use clear nail polish, but I don't know about you. I'm not about to sit here with some small nail polish brush and do all of these. That is too much time. Just put a cardboard down, go in a separate room. If you have a garage or laundry room or go outside on a non-windy day and just spray your jewelry down. I got this really nice tennis bracelet. This one looks so pretty on the website. It's like these really, really small hearts. This is absolutely gorgeous. I thought this was just really, really nice. I like to mix and match jewelry. So like with a tennis bracelet, I think it just looks really, really nice with any type of bangle super cute very affordable and like I said just mix and match it up now this is the two-piece set that I have a tennis bracelet one is a silver color and one is a gold color a little bit smaller than this one as in width but this is the gold and this is the silver you know another bracelet set four-piece bracelet set and it came with all different bracelets now this one I thought was the best out of the set it has like faux crystals on it crystals on it faux diamonds on it really different and really really nice this is definitely nice and then it also came with this tennis bracelet style with gold diamonds on it so you can wear them all together or you can separate them 
Then it has this one right here, which is super cute. And then the last one, which is just a very, very small, thin one. You know what? I should put this on my little granddaughter's wrist. It's so small and dainty. So I did get this ear cuff. So it only came with one. And I do believe it's butterflies. These are my favorite earrings that I did get from Shein. And these are also butterflies. And girl, listen, they have faux diamonds on them. They've never tarnished. I absolutely love them. So this one right here is also butterflies. And this is an ear cuff. Let's see. How do you do this? That's cute, right? You just want to make sure you pinch them in because if you don't, you're going to lose it. Make sure you're real gentle with this because it almost popped the hell off. I just get in and it just almost about to break. I'm not really cool with that. I did get some rings. These are cute. Came in a set. They're snakes. I'm not like the hugest snake person. Well, let me stop lying because I did have a pet snake at a time. But um, yeah, these were just too cute. I thought these was really, really cute. And you like stuff like this. Let me buy these because I do like stuff like this. this Looks so exotic. Hello. Also, I did get these flip-flops, thong sandals. They're kind of like very thick at the foam at the bottom. These are really cute. I like the thickness of this. I like the thickness of the bottom. Like it's almost like a platform. So it's definitely going to fit because I do wear a size 11. So these are my size, my size. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys real quick what I purchased to try on. Now, let me just say this. Y'all probably like, girl, how many pair of those pants you gonna buy? When you find something you like, you buy it in every single color. I don't know about y'all, but at least that's what I do. These are my favorite pants. Now I have them in green and black, and now I do have them in an olive green and gray. And once the yellow and the pink pair come back in stock, girl, I'm on it. I'm on it like white on rice. So let's just get into this the way I can go ahead and head out to karaoke night. Been in a whole lot of pain, now we laughing. Me and Bay making plays till we crashing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't need to be on the scene, we are the scene. Dripping wetter from head to toe, look, baby, me. Yeah, I get what's mine. That's from mine. Be my right. All gas, all gas. No way they gon' never pay. No way they could never break us On next we ain't gonna slow up till All gas Stay down even when we not up No way they could never break us up On God they could only try to keep up I let it ride when I usually would have rolled out I know you grateful that I stay down. We eat a pass in the past, that's all done now. Glad that we stay down. 